What's up, YouTube? Welcome to my channel. If this is your first time, please make sure you press that thumbs up button, like, share, and subscribe. Coming to y'all um, with another video on my Scorpion series. Um, I was on social media and I saw something about um, all men cheat and another st uh, status about that same person talking about uh, polygamy and monogamy and monogamy not being natural. Now I'm going to try to do a video because I'm basically holding um, a discussion as we speak on my um, one of my social media pages to try to see what men and women feel about monogamy. But this um, video was sparked by a Scorpion young man. I think he's like 27. And he said that he has never cheated. He has never had the desire to cheat. He has always been a, a helpless romantic. He's never desired to have multiple women. And that's when I felt like I called bull crap. Now, I almost told the young man, keep living. And this is why, and, and we're going to get into why I say that. We know we can't put anyone into one basket. We can't generalize. We can't say all um, black people are this, all white people are that, all scorpions are that, all Virgos are that, all Libras are that. We can't. There is no absolute. I do know one thing. Scorpion people are relatively very trustworthy and we are very committed people. I will say that, but there is a difference between commitment when it comes to the men and the women. And we know, um, this is for every sign because, you know, with gender men are, you know, they're created differently and women were created differently. I say I call BS, <laughs> you know, not to say the young man is lying, but maybe when he get older, I think. So let me just get right to the video. Scorpio women. I would say we're really, really committed, but that does that mean all Scorpio women is committed. No. I am very committed myself, but this is where. This is where things can go a little haywire. So there's four possible cases where a Scorpio may cheat. Number one, Scorpio is having a fling. It's just sex. Um, he, she won't open up to the partner emotionally, keeps the relation superficial and will be open to sleeping with others too, besides the partner might even tell the partner that it's just sex. Don't expect more explicitly. Such flings seldom last long. You know, you could be, or we could be in that time in our life well, where, you know, we really don't want to be in a serious committed relationship. We like you, but there's not enough that we know about you or enough that we respect about you. And I think with Scorpios, especially Scorpio women, if I can't respect you, our friendship, whatever kind of relationship we have, whether it be romantic or non-romantic, is not going to last that long. Or it may last, but it's not going to be, it's never going to evolve because I don't have that respect for you. If you're too weak of a woman as a friend, if you're too weak as a man in a, a friendship or a romantic relationship, Either you buck up and you get some um, backbone and some respectability about yourself in whatever area that that, that is lacking. Me and you, I, we I, it will end up, you know, um, separating because I can't respect you. You know, I don't respect people that can't make decisions on their own. They got to go. You know, of course, we all, we you know, we seek wisdom for people that have it sometimes. But if you got to seek somebody for everything you gotta tell somebody everything i can't rock with you I, I just i simply can't take you seriously 
Number two, and a, a four possible case where a Scorpio and a cheat. Scorpios in a committed relationship equal will never cheat as long as partners equally loyal and emotional needs are being met. I, you know, <laughs> basically, as long as you're being faithful to me, like I can tell you're being faithful to me, you're giving me your all. You're you don't check out mentally. You don't check out spiritual, spiritually or emotionally. You're there with me. We're building a relationship and you're not abandoning me. And you can abandon someone, not only physically, but you can check out on someone. You could be right there in front of their face. And it's like, y'all not even in the same room together because that person mentally isn't there. They, they're not showing you any love. They're not showing you any care. They're not showing you any of that. So as long as I'm being shown that I can remain faithful to you, but I'm not going to say the moment because I would tell you, actually, I've, I've, I've been in situations where I've gave people more chances that was warranted that they even deserved. And I'm like, look, you know, what's going on, you know? So now that, you know, I'm no longer 18, I'm no longer 20 or nothing like that. You know, I'm only, I'm going to give you lesser chances. I might give you some chances, especially if I like you or I love you or we're in a committed relationship. And let's say if there's children involved or money involved or an apartment, then things is different. You can't just say, oh, I'm out. I'm bouncing. You know, you got to make sure your bread is up. You got to make sure all that. Um, everybody got different situations, but I will say at the end of the day, if I could leave my job, if I could leave after, I mean, decades of people like I really cared about, if I can let them go, I will let a dude go. Like I I really, really would. I mean, that's, I mean, that's just real tight. Whew, let's get to number three. Scorpio is in a committed relationship, but partner cheats. Scorpios are reflective. Get what you give. We can cheat even multiple times and feel no remorse in such a case because we no longer see the need to value and uphold the commitment and that our partner broke. Very true. Very true. Um, I mean, I'm not just saying it cause I'm, I'm, it's saying, I'm saying it, but it's so true. Like, so this information is not just coming from me, but it's information that I have gathered through the years. It's information that I've gotten from Scorpio friends. It's information that I've gotten off the internet. So I, I do study to show myself approved. Um, I believe in that wholeheartedly. If you cheat. And you cheat multiple times. Because I used to say, oh, if a man cheat on me, it's over. Once again, you don't know until you're in that situation. But if you cheat more than once, and let's say I stay with you. Let us let me just, I gave you a free bone. I stay with you for whatever reason. I, I, I took the L. I said, okay, I'm going to stay with you. You cheat again? Oh, you done for, bruh. You done. You done for. You, you could, you could, it's a wrap. And as far as Scorpio men... They say a lot of them cheat. I've heard from women, like I shared in my previous video, when I went to Spain, I met some, you know, dope professional black women, like dope. And they were telling me about their Scorpion brothers, fathers, and all that. Crazy. I mean, crazy. And I'm. it's funny, y'all, when I went back home, I was visiting, and it was this dude, you know, I ain't gonna lie, I think he was like one of the, like, adult boys him i don't know like i don't know i don't know what he did i knew he had some kind of job but then when i went home i saw him always on the block so i'm just like okay what is he doing you know what i'm saying because he never used to hang out over here like that like i said i was visiting uh visited an aunt and i saw him on the block you know because i was there for like a week and he you know was trying to hook up with me like you know oh you were in school blah, blah blah let me get your number blah 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 one time I went to the park to go see him, y'all. Do y'all know, like, they were trying to block me, like, oh, no, his girlfriend over there, like, she crazy, don't, don't go over there. And, like, somebody, I was just, like, thinking about my, I was trying to, like, fix my face because I'm just like, wait, I'm about to go back to school, like, in a day or so, and we've been kicking it since, you know, we would, it was small, kicking it, like, sitting in his car, like, you know, just talking because, you know, I'm a good girl and, 
I just didn't know him like that. And he was always around, like, when I was over there, he was always over, like, outside. That's why I'm on the block. Just outside, posted up, talking to the dudes. I'm just like, why is he in the same, you know, spot every day? I thought he had a job out. You know, whatever. Because you ain't in school, so it ain't spring break for you, too. You know what I'm saying? It ain't spring break for you, too, brother. So I'm just like, I see him and I just turn back around. Then um, he tried to text me the next day. It was a Sunday because that was a Saturday. And um, I was going to church and to my pray for him and trying to send me this barrage of texts. I mean, in my mind, I'm just like, dude, the jig is up. Like you in a full flash relationship. And the thing is, he told me he wasn't. I remember him saying that because I ask questions. That's another thing. Scorpio, we're investigators. I didn't feel a whole need to like do a whole bunch of investigation because granted, I'm only there for a couple of days or a week and I'm not trying to make nothing real serious, but he was acting like, oh, like, you know, I've always liked you and, you know, just all this crazy stuff, y'all. So that's to say that all Scorpios are not, they could be unfaithful, just by shoot nature. If if you're an immature person, no matter what your astrological sign is, that's just what you're going to do. As far as I go, I know I'm a faithful person by nature, but however, I could say that the stuff I wrote down and stuff I'm talking about in this video is some of the reasons I could see myself stepping out. And I'm very honest. That's another thing. I'm very honest about anybody I date. Like if you start messing up and you make me feel a certain kind of way, I'm going to check out too. I'm going to check out. So if you act like you cheating, but she ain't cheating, you messing your own self up because you just going to cause me to do something that I'm going to be like, well, you was acting like this, act like that. So this is what I did. You feel me? So moving on to the next point. Number four, last but not least, it says Scorpio is a player, non principal one, manipulator. I got this one offline. May trick the partner into believing he, she is being faithful, but will cheat on the side. That goes back to the dude I was talking about, y'all. You know, how he was just, I mean, really just glamorized. I just, just, it, he just made it seem so, like, believable. Like, I couldn't. You know, like, it just seems so believable. He seemed, tried to make like he was such an innocent guy, like he was so sincere. And granted, like, if I would have been home longer, then, but I, the thing is, y'all, I was quickly able to detect this dude was not an honest dude. Like, he was a liar, and he was just a fake little fat, uh, escrow wearing hustler. You know what I'm saying? So, that's that. Um, those are the four signs that Scorpios would cheat under. And some people could say, oh, that's whatever you can't say. Cause you really can't. Cause I, I think for women, that's true for all of us. Like if we're, tr- cause my mom is a Virgo. She said the same thing to me. My birth mom, she was just like, you know, she wouldn't leave if a man was cheating. She'll get even. I'm like, dang, shoot. She worse than me. Cause I would, um, yeah, I, I don't know. I, it's hard for me to play games. To me, that's playing games, and not to say that it's not a that they're the game is, that's being played that they're not in the right to play it. It's just a headache. I, I want to just get rid of you. You know what I'm saying? But I do need to learn some Machiavelli tactics, and I have the book. It just was like I couldn't really get into it, y'all. I can't. I'm not even gonna lie. But the answer, if anyone's looking to date a Scorpio woman, we are very loyal as friends. We're very loyal, very faithful. We have our flaws, though. You know what I'm saying? We do. Like, I don't like weak people. And if you irritate me, if I got a headache or if anything, you're going to know it. Like, you're going to know it. It's hard for me to fake anything. Like, it's just difficult. Like, I'm a very authentic, genuine person. That's, to me, an excellent trait to have. As far as Scorpio men, I know some Scorpio men that are faithful, but... The the other ones, they just straight dogs. You know, and I don't I don't mean to put my Scorpion brothers out there. Would I date a Scorpio? Yes. But you gotta be a certain kind of Scorpio. Cause see, he gonna know I'm not the one to be played with. I don't care who you is. You could be 
the scorpion of Nazareth. I'm not playing with you. You ain't going to play with me. And we, and if you are a liar, you out, you out the door, you know what I'm saying? They don't need to lie. So when that young man shout out to him, cause he is the inspiration for this video, he might be faithful. He's only 27. I mean, that's not a baby, but you know, we are hopeless romantics, but I think when a scorpion grows tired and you evolve, you ain't, you always want love, but it's just like, you get to a point where it's like, you got to accept things for what it is and you got to treat it as such. Like in my situation, I kept saying for years, I don't want to do boyfriends anymore. I don't want to do boyfriends, you know? And then I felt like church people was making me try to define my relationship. So now I got to say it's my boyfriend, which I hate that word. I am a grown mother freaking woman i don't use girlfriend boyfriend type. oh that's my boyfriend i'm his girlfriend no we know what it is that's my dude that's my best friend that's my man and if the lord says the same we will get married but that boyfriend stuff that's little kid stuff we don't need no titles we know what it is and secondly if i ain't got no ring on it and he ain't got no ring on it we are single that's what people need to understand y'all don't understand so scorpios i feel like we see things for what it is, and we just honest people. And Scorpio people, like, we're not, okay, Scorp- let me say, Scorpio women, we, I, I, let me speak for some of us, because I know some some hoes out there, but we not hoish, but we like, we like beauty, we like variety. You know, if I'm single, completely single, like I'm unattached, without the marriage, like, Unless I really like you, love you, my my eyes, I ain't purposefully trying to look, but I'm going to notice who looks real good. You know, now I'm, now I'm at the point in my relationship where I don't even, I'm, I, you know, even though I'm not a looker, you know, people that just be looking and breaking their neck, I've never been one of them thirsty types, but because I've had dudes, you know, dudes do that to me. You know what I'm saying? I'm not being arrogant. I'm just saying like, glory be to God. But what I'm saying is, I notice a nice looking man and we all got eyes. We all have a nose. If somebody smell, we're good. You smell them. You know what I'm saying? So let's not get it twisted. But Scorpio, we appreciate like the Libra. We appreciate beautiful things. I appreciate a beautiful canvas, a beautiful teddy bear, a beautiful cake, a beautiful flower, a beautiful rabbit, a beautiful squirrel, the colors in his tail. I see all of that. You know what I'm saying? And you know, so I would just say treat your Scorpio right. You want it to last. And if Scorpio get out of pocket, you got to know how to don't, you can't just put us in pocket any kind of way to think, oh, I'm putting my foot down because you, you might get cursed out and you might get left behind. You know what I'm saying? Like that movie, that rapture movie. So what I'm saying to you is you got to know how to handle us. And if we being disrespectful, you got to know how to bring it to our attention and we will respect you more. You can't do it any kind of way though. Do not showboat us. Don't try to treat us. Don't try to do nothing. But when you got to, Put a little bass in your voice. Put a little bass in your voice. If you a man and you dating a Scorpio woman and she's, you feel like she's unhappy, bring it to attention. Like, look, babe, I'm doing everything. I'm, you know, and more. You seem like you unhappy. Are you happy with me? And she, you will make her realize how she's coming off. And if she like you, which most likely she does, because if she ain't saying nothing, she don't. She don't like you. But if she always brings stuff to your attention, she more than likely she like you. We just got a way of overdoing stuff. We're very passionate people. And I had to tell my guy that. So once again, Scorpio people are very loyal, are committed in relationships. But if you make us feel, especially the women, because the men, some of them holds off top. If you make us feel like you not really in love with us, we not good enough for you. You ain't happy and it's like on a continuum and it's been going on for a while. We might just step out on you. All right, y'all make sure y'all like, share, and subscribe, share this video. You can write your thoughts below. Um, see you on the next, the next video. Peace.